Hi. I'm this is Dr. Aparna, senior consultant neonatologist and pediatrician. Today we are going to discuss about a very common issue that we see in children, post vaccination fever. We know that vaccines are commonly given to improve the immunity and prevent common diseases such as polio, tuberculosis, typhoid, diphtheria, tetanus, etc. There are different types of vaccination. We have one, the live attenuated vaccines such as the BCG vaccine for tuberculosis, measles, mumps and rubella vaccine and the oral polio vaccine. And we have some other vaccines which are the killed vaccination such as diphtheria, pertussis and tetanus vaccination. Now what causes fever after vaccination? We know that whenever any antigen that is disease causing bacteria or virus enters the body, the body mounts an immune response and this immune response is responsible for fever. How do we manage post vaccination fever? The most important thing to remember is not to panic, to continue adequate hydration, infants less than 6 months should be continued on breastfeeding post vaccination, remember to ensure adequate intake of fluids and diet. And with the advice of your pediatrician, you can use paracetamol at the dose of 15 mg per kg orally, which can be repeated at a gap of 6 hours after food, never an empty stomach. Usually post vaccine fever does not last for more than 24 hours. Take the advice of your doctor if there are any other danger signs such as high grade fever, refusal of feeding, excessive irritability or any obvious swelling, redness or pain over the vaccination site. Thank you.